Hey gamers, it's Wintermute here from Grind This Game, back with uh, Oxygen Not Included. The uh, space... I forget the name of it already. <laughs> space Upgrade. No, it the uh, Space Industry Upgrade. That's what it's called. Now someone mentioned there's hatches down in my Bristle Blossom room, so we're gonna... We don't have traps yet, and we don't have ranchers yet, so I'm just gonna attack these guys. Uh, clear them out of there. We have other hatches that can kind of sustain the population. This way we'll get a little bit of free meat as well. I was kind of looking at some other videos of other bases out there and I saw a nice little setup for mushrooms. Okay, there go the hatches. And what I saw was kind of like a... Not a completely sealed room, but kind of a U-shape at the bottom of the base where all the CO2 can collect. And I'm thinking of building something like that for mushrooms. So using farm tiles, um, at this kind of height, and then taking out that kind of stuff. So I don't want them to get uh, trapped in there. I'll try to build it all the way across. They're probably gonna get entombed, but let's try something like this. Actually, I need a. <laughs> I need a wall on the other side so that the CO2 gets trapped in there. Uh, how, do, how do I do this? Let's build a wall here. I gotta get rid of this. Oh, they're gonna get entombed. I can tell already. Uh, I'll, I'll leave some free space for them to get out of there. <laughs> Let's see if this works. Okay, that wasn't planned very well. <laughs> oh, they did it. Okay, so I need a wall to start collecting that CO2. Let's use... I'll keep using sandstone. So I'll put a wall like that. And then I'll, I'll have to get rid of this container here. What do we have in here? Copper? Iron? Get rid of that. Actually, I need to get rid of this as well build a ladder down into that and I'll make it two levels so we'll get rid of this one too that way the co2 can fall in there and hopefully we'll just get a co2 kind of room going on and we'll do a second floor uh, let's see here we can put food on the on this tile I think now I'm, the reason I'm doing mushrooms is just to soak up all the, soak up all the, oh they're going to get trapped in there, actually no they're not, soak up all the slime that we're going to be digging out. In the past I've turned it into algae, but for this playthrough I think I'm just going to try to use it all up in um, using mushrooms instead of algae. We'll see how that goes. Now there is oxygen in here at the moment, so that's not going to work too well. But the CO2 should flow in here and get trapped. I think. That's the theory, at least. We'll see if it actually works. It looked good in the example I, ha I saw, but I don't even know if, that, if I'm doing it exactly the same the way they had it. I think they also had food storage in their... Uh, kind of food room. So that CO2 should be pretty much trapped in here. Now we don't have any spores yet, so we'll have to start digging in here. And I'm going to try to go in here without exosuits, which is kind of crazy, but we'll see how that goes. I'm going to build an airlock maybe right here and do something like this. We'll go in there, we'll put some deodorizers, and we'll try to clean out this air and slowly get into the slime. There's some mushrooms already growing in there, which is good. I should let this water drain out, I think. Actually, there's no rush. No rush for that. We'll do that after the water levels come down a bit. So now we got an airlock. Let's dig to here. Actually, not there. We don't want, uh, we don't want this air flow. Oh, the sand is going to drop. Hmm. Okay. 
let's uh, let's plug this hole first. Seal that up. Seal that up. Now we can dig that out. And I'm going to stick a deodorizer right near the door. One here, one inside the door. And I'll do that high priority, get the sand in there so it's all kind of cleaned up. Well, let's make sure we don't have any hatches. Oh, we got a baby hatch over here. Let's get rid of him. And we have some rotten something or other over here. Polluted dirt. That'll eventually make its way to the compost, so I'm not too worried about that. Okay, priority seven on these. So they keep uh, keep them going, and then we'll crack this open. There's a lot of slime lung in here, but they're they're pretty uh, pretty good in terms of bouncing back from being infected. Okay, there we go. So that'll seep in there. It'll get cleaned. Anything that gets out, I hopefully will get cleaned as well. Let's actually put another one in there, just just so we can clean that air even faster. And I should probably do some research. Okay, don't don't stay in there too long. It's nasty. It's nasty air. Okay, that should limit their exposure. They won't go in there very often. They're gonna have a little bit of slime lung in them now. Let's just check. Ooh, 23,000. But their immune system is only minus 2% per cycle, so they should be okay. A little bounce back. Now, someone mentioned I should be doing statues because they give high decor um, more than the paintings before I can actually do the skill skills for the good paintings. Good call there. What I might do, let's just check vitals here. Oh, we got good morale now. We got plus six from the Great Hall, which is kind of an easy building to build, or room to build. All you really need is a water cooler and a statue, plus a few mess tables, and you're good to go. Now, we need a stove. We've got to cook up that meat. So let's do a stove up here. And I need a smart battery now that I got some... I think I got some refined copper. Yep, let's do a smart battery. And we'll get rid of that regular battery. That'll save us a lot of coal. And I want to crack open this sage hatchling egg. So I'm going to make an egg cracker over here. Maybe over here. All right, let's put it in the food area. Actually, you know what? Going to get rid of that battery. Priority nine. And then build the smart battery right here, just to leave space for another grill. And the egg cracker I think I'll put down here. Let's stick it down. I'll stick it there. Now people were complaining about my double sinks. I'll put them just to the right, that's fine. Generally, their hands are going to be clean, so... You know, if they go in here, they're going to have to exit as well, so... I'll put them to the right. I don't, I don't think it really harms it too much if they're both ways, but... Now we're exploring up this way. We found the cold biome. What do we got up here? More slime biome. We'll just keep making our way up here. Because I just want to see what we can see see where space is, and I want to get in here, get that wheeze work, and explore in both directions. Let's try right this way. Now we can't do that yet because we don't have a miner. So let's go into jobs. We got good morale now, so we can probably... Once Aaron and Gossman are ready, we'll, we'll put them up here because they're they can be tier 8. And... Ruby, auto... We'll promote them. That just has a, a morale requirement of eight, so they should be fine. Auto Rowan. What I'd love to, for them to add is a little tiny arrow to the right of this, which pushes the, the dupe over to the next skill. So there's, so you don't have to go over here and then select from a list. You just hit the arrow and it goes across. That would be nice. And nails, we'll promote nails. 
Same with Meep. I think it's safe. Morale expectation 12. They might get a little bit stressed out, but... And then Snappy, we want good art, so... That should be good for all the promotions. So that's looking good. All the... Okay, I should sweep out this room. I need more storage. Okay, the air's getting clean in here. The slime lung will die in this clean air, so that's good. Food is good. We're making a uh, lice loaf. Okay, let's crack that sage hatch egg. I don't want that. Continuous. And what should we cook first? Uh, barbecue, I think. Do we have any pinch pepper? No. Okay, never mind. We could do crystal berry. Let's do crystal berry first. Party six. And research. Let's keep the research going. I'm just gonna work my way through each column. Insufficient oxygen generation. Oh, that looks fine to me. Jobs mastered, research complete. We have actually we have idle dupes. That is terrible. That is not good. Now we could crack this open. This hydrogen will end up at the very top of the base. Not the end of the world. Um kinda wanna get down here as well. Get in this cold biome. So I might go across and under maybe. Or we could kinda work our way through here. We could try to go through here. A little bit of chlorine would get out. And end up Actually, we don't want that chlorine to get out. Not really. Hmm. We do have pinch of pepper nut in here. Unrefrigerated. But it's in chlorine, so that's okay. Hmm. What to do here? What I could do is crack in... Crack in here. And build a floor across try to seal that chlorine in like this. Now we're not going to be able to get this food. That's all priority 8. That's actually pretty good. So the hydrogen will come out. The CO2 will fall down. The chlorine might start to move its way up. Maybe. But it might just stay there, depending on the pressure and stuff. It's a slightly higher pressure than here, so it might end up Hmm. We'll see how that goes. What else can we be doing here? We can head a little bit to the west here. Actually, they can't dig that yet. That's okay. Is this a smart idea? I think it'll be okay. We'll trap some of the chlorine. We'll head over here. Then we can get in here safely. Let's, uh, we, can we select? Yeah, we can select that, even though they can't build it yet. Oh, no, they can't. Never mind. We got eight dupes. We're going to stick with eight dupes for a while. Uh, they can't get up there yet. Let's just cancel that for now. We can start strip mining this out, though. Let's just start strip mining here. Get this algae, and then some water in there. I'm going to leave that water there. Get that coal out. Oh, and our smart battery. Let's hook that up. Priority 9. That's actually important. We don't want to waste coal. So we'll set the battery recharge to be... I always do 50. 50 and 100. Or not always, but for this I will. Let's check our automation. Suffocating. Uh-oh, did someone get buried? No! Ruby! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, um... Priority 9. Deconstruct that. Priority 9. Get a ladder in there. Oh, they're leaving. 
Actually, Ruby can... Ruby can build it. Get out of there. Whew. That was close. Actually, she's not out of the woods yet. What? What now? Oh, that was Ruby. Okay. A little bit of chlorine got out. I want to seal this breach. Let's do that right away. Wow, stress. I don't want to lose a dupe so early on. I don't know how they fall down like that. Oh, the Draco got out. I wanted the Draco to stay in there. Oh well. Okay, let's harvest some of this good stuff. Okay, a little bit of chlorine got out, but not too bad. Not too bad. And now we can head to the west without too much... Too much... Too many problems. Actually, let's do... Oh, sorry. We'll do like a little corner build here. I should not do party 9. Let's do party 7. Through the corner, they should be able to build unless they change things. That's good. And head this way. Got a lot of water we have to deal with there. They're going to freeze in that water. Actually, that's warm water. Never mind. That'll be fine. But they can't dig through the abyssal yet, so... We'll just leave that. Okay. Chlorine's going to probably end up around here, which is no good. And priorities. I want to change the priorities on disinfect. There is no disinfect by itself. Hmm. You know what? We'll just disable disinfect entirely for now. I think we'll be safe. I usually do that and... Oh, wait a minute. Look at Snappy. Snappy's dirty. She didn't wash her hands. You get back in here. That's not good. Not washing their hands. Okay, maybe I should leave disinfect on. It's so dirty in there. Never mind. I'm just gonna inch it up a bit here to something higher. So they do it, but not all the time. Now we need a place for our polluted water. I could just dump it in here now, now that we have a polluted water area. How's the slime lung in there? Still pretty bad. It is slowly dying off. I do kind of want to get that muck root, even though it's kind of silly. Uh, what to do? What to do? How's our how's our miners going? Oh, they're ready. Okay, perfect. Aaron. Oh no, they're not. They're almost ready. And research is coming along, almost done. I'm gonna go super speed for a little while here. Just let them catch up. We don't want, we don't want them idle, so let's sweep up the rest of the base here. And we're done the research. Okay, air systems next. Control U is like for debug. I mean, sorry. If you have debug enabled, but not even turned on, you can use the super speed using control U. And I kind of like it because I played the game so much that I kind of don't want to wait around for stuff sometimes. And I think it makes for a better experience for you guys. Maybe. Oh, we got hydrogen collecting, so let's fix that. Get some airflow in here. The risk of using super speed is a dupe getting in a bad place and getting stuck and things flying by too fast and them expiring. Okay, I need a place for algae to go. Maybe I'll put some storage underneath this. I don't want them to see the storage containers that much. Let's just put a few here. And we'll put algae, but only sweep only. Because we don't want them grabbing algae from dirty areas. And we'll probably have enough for two, so let's just do that. 
Okay, no hatches in the food. That's good. We got pollution going on in here. I think we need another compost. But my bathroom's already kind of full. We could put a door here, but then we got slime. Uh, we could probably safely get some slime out of there. Oh, but we have no mushroom seeds. <laughs> we need to get over here and get some mushrooms out of here. Hmm. Okay. Let's do some more research. What should we do now? Let's do fossil fuels. We got good paintings. Let's finish off all the good paintings. And we got dupes over here. So let's put uh, let's put some art in here above where they're hanging out a lot. And let's get them in the bedrooms. Might run out of granite. 400, let's do sandstone here. Okay, food's actually getting a little bit low. Can keep strip mining all this out. That's low priority. Good, good. And once we get stripped down, stripped down here, strip mine down here, we can head to the each direction and kind of peek, peek into each area. And can we dig this yet? I'm not quite sure. No. Oh yeah, our guys are probably ready now. Yeah, Aaron. You, Gossman. I saw a really creative idea for the. A bristle blossom farm, which kind of, because the light can go through the cracks, it was like a whole bunch of bristle blossom farms using a, one, a single light. I might try to build that at some point. Looked pretty nice. Okay, algae. I think they got it all in storage now. That's good. How much algae do we have? Hmm. Not a whole lot. And we're dependent on algae at the moment. For oxygen. Hmm. Hmm. There is quite a bit around here, so let's just start to get all that. Let's build our next floor here. And then the next one will go here. Let's go this way. We'll see what's over here. Hopefully there's no germs there. Oh, there is. You stay out of there. See what's over this way. And we'll head... Actually, I should put my airflow first. Make sure there's no germs in here. Oh, there is. Should kind of duplicate this up here. Probably don't need all this space. It's gonna be a pretty big base, actually. Hmm. That's okay, though. We'll just fill them out with oxygen. <laughs> it's a bit of a waste, but eventually that's what our, where I want to get to. Instead of building uh, my oxygen generation off in a cold room somewhere, I thought about just doing it right at the bottom of the base. Even though it makes hot oxygen. Oh, it's actually getting warm in here already. If we get enough weasworts in the base, it might be okay. Okay, I kind of want to head in here now. How do I want to do it? Uh, I guess water's kind of in the way. Let's go down this way. There's actually no slime lung in this polluted oxygen here. So what I might do is go down here. Maybe let the water drain in here, even though it would be good to have for the 
slime to fall into. Hmm. Ooh, that's decayed. That's never good. Oh, we're really low on food. Holy crap. Uh... Hmm. Let's actually do... Uh, our food is about to sprout here. 97%. Okay, that's good. We'll be okay. Famous last words. Okay, let's... Uh, I'm going to dig underneath here. I've got nowhere for this slime to go, though. I could put the slime underwater. In here. I think that's what I might do. Slime that's underwater doesn't give off polluted oxygen. And this is actually really close to our room. Pretty close to our room, so... This will be our little slime storage for now. And I don't think the slime lung will get in the water, so... Let's try to stick... Uh, I thought it was under organic. Oh, we don't have any yet. That's why it's not in there. Okay, let's go dig some slime. Let's go here and here. Get that slime. And then we'll stick it in this container. And it should be safe. Till we get some mushroom seeds. Fungal spore. Next research. Uh, advanced power, sure. We're not going to use that for a while, but... Oh, we got to dig this out. Without getting into those germs. Oh, get out of the water. Don't want you in there. Let's make this eight. I wish I could select slime before we actually have it. I'll just select organic. We'll see how that goes. And then we'll clear it and we'll just put slime in it. Okay, there they go. Now we can select just slime, I think. Slime, priority eight. Maybe seven. That way it won't bubble off all the nasty air. Oh, and someone mentioned don't don't dig the muck root, dig the tile beneath the muck root. Good tip. Save some time. Okay, there goes the slime. Oh, look at them. Covered. Go wash your hands. We'll stick them in the bathroom. If we can find the bathroom. Go over here, and then they'll be forced to wash their hands on the way out. There they go. I should probably put a sink down here. Because they're going to get covered in nasty nastiness. Let's actually do that. Medicine. Wash basin. I don't think the slime on them will be too bad, but... Can't be too careful. Now, what do I want to do in here? I think I want to crack through here, let all this water dump out to the bottom. Just do this, like that. Do the big drain. They're gonna get wet, I know. I'm sorry. I want to get over and get those mushrooms. We could actually go from the top. There's a little bit of slime lung in the CO2 in there, but that's okay. Let's just actually go like this. Maybe we can get around that slime. A little bit, kind of, maybe not. Uh, yeah, we could go right here. Put an airlock there just to keep things Nice and tidy. And then we'll dig down here. I don't want to disturb this thimble reed, but I think I will. Because there's still more natural growing thimble reed. We'll be okay. Or I could just dig up the slime. Oh. Uh, we'll do that. Just as is. 
I think that'll work. Maybe. Okay, food's back up. Good. I want to get those mushrooms growing. They're good uh, slime sponges. Okay, we got a fungal spore there. Good. Don't let that don't let that puffed out. That would be bad. Okay, there they go. Getting all the mushrooms. Yum yum. And we can start putting these in fungal spore plant. Party seven. Copy those settings. Actually, let's put them in the bottom first. There we go. Looking decent. Stress is going up slightly. Let's get rid of these wires. I'm somewhat satisfied how things are going. Okay, they're gonna go in there and get all that uh, fungal spore. Let's set these to harvest. A little bit more over here. Still cleaning that air in there. I don't want them to go in there just yet. We'll just let the air get even cleaner. C copy the settings here. The slime. They can get in there, right? No seed. Oh, I thought I had a seed. I thought I had a fungal spore. No, I don't. Hmm. Interesting. I thought I saw one for sure. Oh, it's growing. Never mind. There it is. Oh, they're so happy about the research. Okay, moving along. Medical research, which we might need soon. If we get too much slime lung in the base. Could do more bristle blossoms. We're kind of over ODing on food here. That's okay. Let's take a lamp here. Actually, I should have used farm tiles, but that's okay. This is temporary. This might be a little bit more long term. <laughs> Okay, let's keep our strip mining going and our exploring. Let's go this way, now that we can get into the Abyssalite. And let's go get, uh, let's go get that Weezwort. Get it in the base. Actually, let's just dig the tile instead. And we don't want to disturb this wild sleet wheat. We want to, we want to keep using it. Because we love it. We love wild growing sleep wheat. And I'm gonna try to get access to it here. No, not that one. Uh, and then get that out of there. I just wanna see what's over here. And let's set these to harvest. It'll be a while before we can harvest them, but. And we'll go the same, we'll do the same thing to the left here. Go that way. Food shortage. Uh, okay, I guess mush bars for a little while. This food should be ready soon. Oh, I need, I need light. Power for that light. Once these mushrooms get going, I think we'll be fine for food. We got mushrooms right here. We need another uh, cooking station. Oh, we can use gold. We have lots of it. Decent amount of it. Uh, 
Better not starve to death. I gotta keep an eye, a close eye on algae, because if we run out of algae, we're in big trouble. Okay, on this one, we're gonna do fried mushrooms. Continuous. Priority seven, sure. Let's check our jobs. Everyone's still working away. It's time for the dog to bark. Not my dog, but likes to bark whenever I record. Just keep going to the left here. See what's in here. Now they might get chilly in here. And a little bit of this heat is going to dump in here, but... Ooh, it has decayed. I could build, build a chlorine storage for my... My uh, food, that would kill the germs, that would be good. I could use this area. Okay, moving along. Oh, we got water, no. Okay, is it germy water? I hope not. I think this is from things melting up here. Oh yeah, what a disaster. Okay, I'll make this a little bit higher, and then we'll put a little stopper so the water can't drain out of there. We'll let all that water flow down. That's okay for now. That'll just fall into our water pit. It's actually nice and cold, so... It's actually okay, except for them walking through the water. We don't like that. Make these weasel work. Things, uh, higher priority. Okay, let's go super speed. We'll just let them kind of catch up here. I think there's some sleet wheat growing here, so we don't want to disturb that. Cancel that. Okay, what's over here? Should be on the lookout for some geysers. Mind that out. We got a lot to do here. Might as well mop this out. Let's do this as seven. And for airflow, I'm going to open that up. Oh, that was fast. Uh, distillation next. My shine bugs are kind of getting loose in the base and stuff. That's okay. Air is still being cleaned in there, slowly. Okay, we got crystal berry, we got fried mushrooms. Oh, maybe that's the job completed sound. I think it is. Now, we don't want to go over here yet because we don't have morale that high. So, nails, maybe you can go become a gopher for a while. Everyone else just keep working away. Oh, and I have some new names I gotta add. Let's see who we have here. Uh, Meep will become Soup. Because he's a chef. Soup, welcome. And we have uh, Gossman will make Captain G, I think. Make sure I get the spelling right here. Cap. 
Captain G. And who else do we have? We have Otto can become Boom the Mech. Boom the Mech has been in I think five of my bases now. Okay, they're getting in here. Oh, well, we gotta take that so they can get in. Now I'd like to find some lockers and find some warm clothing for them. Strip mine that. Really, really, I should put an airlock in here now so we don't just lose all our oxygen. I did want some in the tunnels, but I think maybe for now. I'll leave it for now. Pressure's still good. Oh yeah, polluted water pit. Still haven't done that. Now we could stick it down here because... Except this is clean polluted water. This is germ-free polluted water. Versus disgusting foul food. Food poisoning water. I could put a thing in here for it. Uh, where to put the nasty water? Hmm. I might just dump it in here. Yeah, let's just do it. We'll mix our mix our disgusting waters. Because it'll be okay. <laughs> Priority nine. Uh, we'll stick blue water in there. Priority six. Still got lots of slime lung in here. But it should clean out eventually. We're getting a little bit of polluted oxygen just from the polluted water in here, but... eventually be okay. A little bit of slime lung got out here, but that's... No one's immunity is going down yet. Okay, research. I just want to look at some of the new stuff over here. We got... Tons of new rocketry stuff. Precision plumbing. Oh, let's see, espresso machine. Actually, when, he, when we get over there, we'll get over there. So for now. And I need some uh, insulation in the base. To keep the hot areas out. Actually, it's not that hot around the base. Never mind. We're okay. Okay, let's stop with the mush bars. That should be the end of the mush bars. Because we've got all this meal lice, we've got mushrooms on the way, we got bristle blossoms. Okay, I think I need even more deodorizers in here. Let's put one here, here, here. Can they get down there? Oh, they can build it, no problem. Probably mop this up. Can't they can't mop that up? Never mind. We'll eventually get in here. Well, we already got in this way, so. It's all good. It's looking good. Just need these mushroom seeds to multiply. Then we can really hit the slime. I do want a chlorine storage room though. But I need to build a water lock. I don't really have enough room for the water lock right here. Could go in here. There's a little tiny bit of it. Not really enough for storage though. Unless we flatten the room out a bit. Still trying to get these wheeze warts. because it's a low priority. Let's get in there.
go left and we'll go here. Go over here. We're really searching for a steam or water geyser because that's going to help things a lot. Set harvest here. Harvest on all this nice sleet wheat. Go a bit faster. Okay, we got our wart seed. Let's actually use it. Where is it hottest? Just a little bit of heat here. We don't need that manual generator there anymore. Let's get rid of that. So I'm going to build a flower pot out of granite right here. Keep this area cool. Now we got three wheeze warts. Beautiful. It's pretty warm up here by the battery, so I'll put a, a wheeze wart there. It's still nice and cool down here by the food, so that's not a problem. Just as long as we cool up this machinery, or cool off this machinery, I think we'll be okay. Now these composts give off give off a lot of uh, heat, so what I might do is remove this one deodorizer and put a put a wheeze ward in there. Okay, wheeze ward. Oh, I need more art. Got to replace my paintings. Party nine, uh, no. I'm gonna run out of granite again. Actually, no, I'm not. I got lots of that. Let's put some nice paintings in here. One there. I like. Getting soggy feet there. Maybe we can mop that up. Oh yeah, the game's... This update is officially out as of today. Well, by the time you watch this, it'll be yesterday. Okay, research. Improve ventilation. Actually, for the research, what I should be doing is just doing it like this, so then it will go through everything. But I'll start at the top. Do animal, animal control next. Let's get our bees ward in there, cool things down. It's a well-oiled machine, this base. Get the art done. Water will run dry eventually. We'll crack open this one. And by then, hopefully, we have, will have found a steam geyser. I'm going to go in here. This hydrogen will get out. Of, that's okay. I'm going to stick a door here. Just to keep that Dreco, these Drecos in here. And we'll head down into here. Do some exploring. Did that as priority nine. That's a little bit excessive. We'll get in here, explore in there. Some nice water here. Iron. We like iron. This could be a chlorine storage room. It's a little bit far away from the base, though. Because we have food decaying. Maybe I'll go across here.
And let's do a harvest on everything in here. And slowly make our way in there. Might use airflow tiles here. Let's take that and that. Slowly make our way to the left. What do we have over here? Ooh. Careful. <laughs> Don't you guys suffocate. There's a lot of wheeze. Ooh, a lot of wheeze warts in here. A lot of free food in here. Oh, who's suffocating? Oh, no. How do they do this? How do they do this? Ah, uh, okay. Hmm. Aaron, you might be a goner. You just might be a goner. Okay, you can get down to here. How are we going to get you out of here? Hmm. You start digging your way down here. And we will build up to you. Here and out. I hope that works. Hope he survives. Get down there. Get down there. Oh no. Oh, this looks bad. Aaron might be a goner. Oh no. He didn't even. Couldn't even get down there. Oh jeez. Poor Aaron. Oh, I just canceled that build. No. <laughs> He's never going to get out of there in time. Uh, jeez. He's not going to make it. No. Is there, oh, there's oxygen up there. Uh, there's oxygen here. No. Oh, he's breathing. He's breathing. Oh, now he's stuck again. Okay. <laughs> Save him. I thought he was going to be safe. No, come build. Build, 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 build. Get out of there. Okay, we don't need these. He can get down here. As long as we build. We have granite around here, so I'm going to use granite. Get out. What is he doing? Get out. Get out. Go, Aaron, go. Oh, okay, perfect. Well, not perfect, but... Dupes. You gotta love them. Smart little critters. Okay. Uh, what should we do now? I'm gonna do... I need another cook. Cooking grill. I'll stick it over here. Doing everything priority nine. That's kind of silly, but... That wheeze ward in there. No, we don't have any more wheeze warts. That's okay. When we do, we'll be ready. Copy the settings there. The grills give off a decent amount of heat. Let's do research. Let's check jobs. Jobs are mastered, I think. Uh, let's get nails up here. Good, good. Okay, we want, uh, what did I just get? Now I can make frost buns. What do stuff berries need? Pinch pepper nut. Let's do frost buns, because we got sweet wheat grain. Quite a bit of it. We have a little bit of pinch pepper nut, but I think I'll do... Do some frost buns. Yum, yum. And what do we need for berry sludge? Whistleberry and sleep with green. I'll just 
leave it as light slope for now. That's using a lot of water, but we'll find more water. I promise. We got ice. That means water. Okay, where we need to we need to find a geyser. Maybe this map wasn't the best map. Uh, it started out nice. Let's go to the left here. See what we can see. I should probably search for a geyser. You can see them easier with this because... Oh, can't even get in here. Because you can see the neutronium. I'm also going to go this way. See what I can see. See what's in here. Might have to wrap up this episode. It's getting pretty long. How's coal? Coal is decent. Algae is running low. Could use a fire pole along here. Already six fire pole. Six ladder. We'll go up here. We'll get those wheeze warts. And continue up this way. Restroom out of order. Oh no. And we got stress creeping up. Fix the toilets. Party eight. Okay, that was probably unnecessary. Now I got a good tip about the scheduling. Someone said, don't even bother with a bath time break. Just use three downtime and they'll just go to the bathroom during their downtime. I could try it out. I'm a little bit worried they'll Forget to go to the bathroom. Things will become a disaster. And I also got a good tip saying if the bathrooms are in sync, clean one out manually. And then they'll they'll get kind of offset for the cleaning. But I'm gonna wrap this episode up. We got a lot done. I'm pretty happy with how things are shaping up. We just need to find a geyser. Steam geyser. And then we'll be off to the races. And until then, we have ice. We can melt some ice. In fact, we could just do like ice sculptures like here with a uh, mesh tile underneath. This is a kind of a cheaty way, not a cheaty way. This is kind of a manually slow way to get cooling and free water, or not free water, get water in your base. Just build ice sculptures once in a while. Yep, yeah, so I'm going to wrap things up here. I uh, hope you enjoyed that episode. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.